Hey, today I want to talk to you about how to get boys to like you. Because I look like a giant dumb whore, you probably think I know all the secrets. And I do. If you don't have time to watch this whole video, just know the quick method is to put his dick in your mouth. Maybe the balls. However, the quick method won't make him actually like you. It'll just make him like your mouth. Same thing goes for your butthole and vagina. Those things are a dime a dozen. So if you want him to like you for longer than it takes for him to spew his baby gravy all over you, then I suggest the long method. If this is someone you're meeting for the first time, make sure you tell him all about yourself. How many kids you want to have? I want four, and I can't wait to get fat and eat whatever I want. An uncomfortable story about your childhood. My uncle used to touch me. And above all else, make sure you get way too drunk to calm those nerves. I want three of those shots that you light on fire. Nothing says call me later quite like puking up your Caesar salad on him. If you somehow manage to hang out with him again, probably because you scared him, make sure you talk about all the things you have in common. Although it's not likely that you have anything in common, because all of your interests include Oh my god, shoes! Cosmo! Oh my god, I'm mostly sees too. Or you can force your common interests. For example, guys love sports. To make him like you, you don't have to actually like sports. You can just read ESPN.com or listen to 30 Seconds of Sports Center and regurgitate it verbatim to him. LeBron James had 24 points and 9 rebounds and 6 turnovers in 41 minutes against Indiana. Basketball. This makes him and all his friends think you're just one of the guys. She really knows her shit. Another thing guys really like is when you steal something of theirs and never give it back because they love when you have it. When he's not around, guys love when they hear from you to tell them how much you're thinking about them. Just heard our song on the radio. Ass, 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 ass. When he doesn't text you back, that just means he wants you to keep texting him. One, four, three, question mark? And call him. Where are you? Post on his Facebook wall. I miss our talks. Wink. Tweet at him. I thought we had something real. Message him on Facebook. I guess I was wrong. Accidentally bump into him somewhere because you saw where he checked in on Facebook or Foursquare. Oh my god, I didn't know you were going to be here. And if he hasn't responded, just make sure you swing by his house. I know where you live. I like your new curtains. Text him too so he knows you're there. I can see your fucking car. I know you're home. Stop ignoring me. Who's fucking... What fucking car is that? If all else fails, just tell him some awkward period stories. Guys love that stuff because they can't get a period. The curiosity is killing them. This method of getting boys to like you has worked for rational, logical women for centuries. I mean, if you can't get a guy to like you doing all of these things, you might as well just get some cats and call it quits. Don't forget to hate men for the rest of your life. Oh, do you hear noises? Pour some marbles on me. Where in the fuck is my silver unicorn? Oh, you brought me a blue monkey. What a sweetness. You know who else Carmen looks like? Mr. Burns. Excellent. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. We put out new videos every Wednesday. Creepy face. <laughs> Don't run away. Okay, bye. Fine, I know. Blue monkeys are just calling you. You gotta go. You gotta go. You're hugging me. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it, but this is really weird. I know. Okay. Well, I guess this is how it's gonna work then. All right. I guess we'll we'll see you next week. Say bye, Spider-Man. Bye, Spider-Man. What the fuck? Okay. Bye.